Welcome back to KBC Prime Edition. It's now time for sports. My name is Karen Kibet. The Junior Starlets team to the 2024 FIFA Under-17 Women's World Cup was flagged off today by President William Ruto in a ceremony held at the State House, Nairobi. The team was led by head coach Mildred Cheche, who named her final squad today, ahead of their departure tomorrow for a pre-World Cup training camp in Spain. Speaking during the flag of ceremony here in Nairobi, President William Ruto reiterated the government's efforts to support the junior team fully during the pre-camp training in Spain and the actual event, the FIFA Under-17 Women's World Cup in the Dominican Republic. To you who have qualified to be in the team, I want to say to all of you, even as you travel, congratulations for achieving this feat. <laughs> Meanwhile, head coach Mildred Cheche named her final score today, which includes, among others, striker Valerie Nekesa, Marion Serenge, Jen Kweyu, defenders Elizabeth Ochaka, Kimberly Akinyi, midfielders Velma War, Halima Imbachi, Rebecca Odato, Nancy Onyango of Nyakach Girls, and Paul Olasi, goalkeepers Velma Auma, and Effie Owar of Madina Girls. This team are our small sisters. We have supported them for the last two years. We are proud of them. And as the women leaders, we're actually proud that for once, the women are the ones who are going to take Kenya to the World Cup. The players who were dropped are Claire Marys, Michelle Waithera and Cheryl Amok, who sustained a knee injury during the East African school games, whom President William Ruto said will travel with the team nevertheless to boost their morale. Charlene, Claire and uh, Michelle. Uh, I know they made a huge contribution towards getting us here. They may not be in the team that will play, but as has been asked, I want them to be in the team that will accompany you and be part of this historic event as a representative of all the others who participated. The coaching staff said they based their selection criteria on a balance of fitness, form and tactical alignment to ensure the team's readiness for their debut. As sports community secretary Kipchumba Murkomen added they have plans to introduce the junior leagues across the country to tap more talents. The thing about this experience is that your excellency, no matter what happens uh, in this exposure to these young people, is going to open doors for a number of these players and uh, watch this space. You will be seeing some of these young people here playing in uh, top leagues in Europe and other parts of the world. The junior starlets, who are the first Kenyan team to ever qualify for FIFA World Cup tournament, will kick off their campaign against England on 18th of October before they face Korea, DPR and Mexico. For Prime Edition Sports, I'm Daniel Mwendwa.